Hey, good afternoon. I turned up a home music server with a Blue Sound Node 2i DAC that I run on Ethernet. So I had to run Ethernet to my stereo cabinet. So while I was running Ethernet to the stereo cabinet, I figured I'll run Ethernet to anything that's got an Ethernet jack on it. So I've got eight items that need Ethernet, but my router only has four ports. So I bought a Netgear Ethernet switch to add the other items into it and get it on my network. I really have no idea how to do this. I am not an IT guy. I muddle through most of this and miraculously it works in the end. So I'm going to show you guys what I got. We're going to unbox this Netgear Ethernet switch. So this is an 8 port gigabit switch, quote, unmanaged. That's why I bought this. Unmanaged to me means very little interaction with myself because I don't know crap about this stuff. It's got two ports of 10 gig and then it's got multi gig which it's supposed to determine what speed your equipment wants and adjust itself accordingly. Well, let's open this up. That's a hot ticket. 24-7 support. I hope I don't need it, but it's nice to know it's there. Got the instructions. That's important. And here she is. I bought this because they advertise it as wall mountable. I'm going to hang this on the wall and hook it into all my Cat 7 jacks that I have in the back bedroom. It's got brackets for a rack mount. It's got the anchors for wall mount. It's got all the hardware for rack mount, wall mount, and the power cord. Boy, this looks super simple. There's the best thing about this baby. Unmanaged switch right up my alley. We'll see how true that is. I brought this Ethernet switch into where the computer, the router, and the modem are. So I have a computer, I have my NAS, I have my DAC, and I have a PlayStation 4 hooked to this, and then I have the Ethernet switch hooked to my router. So according to the instructions, the two green lights I got one gig, two green lights I've got one gig, two green lights I've got one gig, these two green lights I've got one gig, now these are these not, ports 9 and 10 are the 10 gig ports. The double yellow is 1 gig. And this took absolutely no provisioning whatsoever for me. This is 100% plug and play. For me, this was a total success. This was so painless, I can't believe it. So if you're looking for an unmanaged network switch, I would suggest a Netgear. This is a GS110MX. And as it's advertised, unmanaged, absolutely. I have a Netgear router, and that has worked flawlessly, so that's why I bought the Netgear Ethernet switch. And I give this a two thumbs up. I wish I had more hands to give it more thumbs up. So I'm totally satisfied with this. It took no interaction from me other than plugging in all my cables and applying power. So happy switching. Thanks for watching.